I'm going to demonstrate an issue uh, with the scroll position in uh, your text view if you begin or end editing. Um, this issue uh, might have to do with the fact that I'm not using a, a text view as direct descendant of or direct view of a view controller but rather uh, a sub view of the main view and that's necessary because I have some other logic going on and unfortunately this disables the automatic setting of the content inset uh, for scroll views that a view controller would otherwise be able to do for us. Um, in order to prevent the, the text from going underneath the keyboard uh, I'm observing two uh, notifications for uh, showing and hiding of the keyboard and in the showing I'm adjusting the uh, content inset and the scroll, scroll indicator inset uh, to be the height of the frame that's covered um, and I'm reversing this to zero uh, when the keyboard hides. This code was working flawlessly under iOS 7 but um, uh, it should also work in iOS 8. Now let me demonstrate uh, the, the issue. Um, I prepared a nice uh, sample with instructions so you can easily see the problem. So this is this has some text here and first thing you do you scroll down uh, to the arrow you align it with the bottom of the navigation bar and this is the position that I would expect to be preserved when I start editing because the cursor is in, in no danger of being uh, hidden by something but as soon as I tap here you will see there's a jump going on yeah it's now uh, the, the cursor is at the on top of the uh, keyboard and the arrow arrow has moved so we move it back yeah because the second thing that also happens is uh, if if we have this position now if I'm hiding the keyboard I also expect uh, for the scroll position to be preserved yeah if, if I'm typing here yeah and now I'm resigning the keyboard again you see that uh, the scroll position changed by almost half a screen yeah so that's bug number two hiding the keyboard the scroll position should also not shift now something that's also annoying is uh, we have another arrow here at the bottom so I scrolled all the way down uh, and if I start typing here, yeah, we already expect that there's some shift uh, uh, going on, but of course that's necessary uh, uh, so that the, the text is not hidden. Uh, but uh, let's say I've uh, written something very important here at the bottom. If I now resign the keyboard, I don't see it anymore. And thus, as a user, I'm confused. Hey, my God, where's, where's what I wrote? And I noticed that I'm uh, about half a, half a screen away from what I would expect it to see. I would expect this to see uh, to be uh, at the maximum scroll position if, if I was uh, so far down in the document. So there you have it. These are the, the main three bugs of this radar. Um, there's a bonus bug while the keyboard is showing and if you scroll by giving it such flicks look at the indicator on the right side do you see how check check this is it's always moving and also sometimes changing changing size uh, that's not so pronounced on uh, a device at least not on my iOS, uh, iPhone 6 but it's it looks weird and broken on the simulator here so there's there's some performance problem as a bonus bug so this is my radar about the text view scroll offset bug when showing or hiding the keyboard